everybody. All right, my name is Soleil. Today I'm gonna to be talking about clothing I have purchased from several brands. One is from Fox Blood, the other one is from Black Milk. I am doing a separate video for Fox Blood, and this video is uh, the four pieces of apparel that I purchased from Black Milk. I currently have the one skirt on. I cannot wait to show you guys. I'm obsessed. I'm also surprised. So um, give me a minute and I will adjust the camera so you can see my skirt. All right, so this is the skirt. This is from their mermaid collection. It has two slits up the thigh. Love that, love the sequence. Hopefully you'll be able to see the shimmer that I'm seeing. It has got a beautiful corally pink to gold shift on top of the blue material. It is just absolutely stunning, I love it. Um, just to reiterate from the other videos I've talked about, my measurements, I am 160 pounds, 5'4", I wear a size 12, also a size large. This is a size large. It is a little long on me, so I put on some four inch heels or wedges, and I think I probably could have put on fives because it's still kind of dragging. Um, so if you're a 5'4 or below and you want to buy a skirt like this from Black Milk or this skirt specifically, then you just keep in mind you might either have to hem it or uh, wear some high heels with it. All right, so the thing that kind of surprised me that I'm like, I don't get, is that it came with underwear attached to it. I, I don't, I don't get that. I don't understand why they needed to put underwear. The main like annoyance is that the underwear is attached all the way up to the top of the skirt and the skirt on me goes all the way up, like the middle of my back. So I have underwear pretty much going all the way up the middle of my back. It's just kind of weird, so. Um, I guess black milk, if you ever happen to see this video, you don't need to do that. We got our own underwear, it's cool. Um, unless you have some vision in your mind of somebody like play fighting or wrestling around and maybe showing their underwear and you decide to go ahead and, I, I just, I guess if you're gonna do the, this, like what I'm doing right here, I can get that then. Maybe that, if you're squatting like this, maybe it's a thing wherever, because they're in Australia, maybe people squat like that, I don't know. Um, I know in Korea they do, so maybe they were trying to, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what their thinking process was on the whole entire inseam underwear, but anyhow, love the skirt, don't care for the inseam underwear. I will now go on to the next uh, piece of apparel. All right, so this is their uh, Black Crow print dress. I bought this so that I could have like a fun little flowy dress for work because it covers my chest and everything. I feel like it's definitely work appropriate. I'm gonna go ahead and get closed. Hopefully you'll be able to see the, the birds on it. I definitely love this. It's giving me kind of like these kind of dark gothy vibe, which I definitely dig. And uh, it comes to my knees, which I think is again, perfect for work. I can wear little heels, I can wear my little combat boots. Um, I definitely am digging this. So, again, pretty little dress, definitely digging this. All right, on to the next outfit. All right, this is the other dress that I bought also for work. It has pockets, which I love me some pockets. It seems to be a little longer, definitely. It goes past my knees. Again, I can probably get away with little shoes, combat boots, little heels. Uh, I will be wearing a cardigan with it when I'm at work. It's got a little um, dragon print, which I'm really digging, and it's got like a velvety feel to it. The only thing I think is kind of weird is that there's no front or back, which I don't really understand why they do that, but um, it's not that serious. It's just kind of strange. Otherwise though, um, I'm digging it. I think it's definitely, definitely cute. Definitely cute. Onward to the next. All right, this is the final dress that I purchased. I am definitely digging it. I got a size 16 because they came in like numerical numbers opposed to like medium, large, extra large. It was like 12, 14, 15, 16. And I looked at the size chart and I went with the 16. I will say this, so like I purchased some other dresses. I should have put them on, but I didn't see a point because they were just so large on me. 
Um, and I got them in a size 16 and they were just huge on me. So I ended up returning them and um, I was thinking when I, I pulled this this side, I'm like, ugh, I'm gonna end up having this be too big. But it actually, it's slightly big, but it's not like extremely big. So I definitely can get away with wearing this with no problems. So um, yeah, I definitely love this. Just keep in mind if you shot from Black Milk, you have to kind of know your sizes. There's a chance you're gonna have to return the uh, item to figure out what size really fits you. So far for me, large definitely fits me. I think I probably could have gone with a size 14. I would have been okay with this. Um, but I'm fine with the 16 too. So, for this specific dress that is. It is cute. Very whimsical. Very fairy like I'm digging it. Yes, bitch, yes. I love the lace. And it's perfect length for me. Anytime I see something that says midi, I'm like, all right, midi for me is like maxi, so. That concludes my video, me putting on different things from Black Milk Clothing. I mentioned before, they're in Australia. I am in the United States, but I definitely feel that the clothing they do have is worth the wait, and I will continue to purchase from them. Um, every time they come out with a new collection, I am on the email list now. I want to see what they're coming out with, and uh, I usually like at least one thing out of every collection. So that is, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I'll be making more videos in the near future, and I'll see you guys next time.